Hey guys, we're here trackside, just coming off a lightning delay, about to go get some runs in. How are you feeling with the new build, man? Feeling great, man. Compared to last year, we're dialed in, great track, great practice so far, we're ready. Dude, you're looking great. Appreciate it, man. Compared to last year and having all the mechanicals coming out, we got a test session in before this, same layout. We're dialed, brother. Dude, I'm excited to see it. Car looks great, you're out there. How are you feeling with that little uh, bump I'm seeing on that uh, main sweeper off the end tree? I'm seeing a lot of drivers getting either knocked down or they're getting into the wall. Well, what's going on? You're talking about coming off the bank? Oh, no, first off, when you're in the middle of the bank. Oh, when I'm in the middle of the bank, no problems, bro. Are you, you're, you're, you got um, dialed. I haven't felt any slip on that wall yet. That might be because I'm not high enough or that might just be because I'm left foot breaking and I feel more planted, but it's so good so far, and we're hyped this season. We got full support from them, and we're ready to make it happen. Heck yeah, man! Well, I'm excited to see you out here. What's the goal? What are you really trying to do today? What's what's the end all be all? Brother, we're trying to get comfortable, and I mean, everybody wants to win, right? So that's, that's the goal. what I, that's what I want to hear, man. Hopefully, you get something. See you on the podium, baby. Happy life. coming out we had a lightning delay we've had all kinds of stuff going on you were practicing yesterday i just saw you coming off beating up your steering wheel what's yeah. going on dude i was stoked i was really i was doing good last night and doing okay during the day and then you know later on it's been just like more rough cars we looked up i was driving like like a b-word and uh you know i was getting really annoyed so the lightning delay i came back loosened the car up stopped being a b-word yeah, I just did my thing and the car was perfect, line was good, car felt great, and uh, I'm stoked, so. Dude, you're looking great out there. I came over and I gave you the, the hey, you're killing it, slow go out there, getting some runs in. You're definitely on the wall more than you usually are. I feel like you're trusting the car more. So it, it's big stuff because, I mean, hell, what is it? Even a couple months ago, you weren't like this, so. Oh, no, no, yeah, I mean, I haven't done bank tracks much because I don't do it unless I have to, as in, like, stuff like this. Right. Because there's a lot of risk. And when you have to do it, it's really fun, and you just got to do it. If you think about it, you're going to have a bad time. Well, drifting's a risk and reward, man. You got to risk it all to get the reward. You're out here trying to get the biggest reward. I know you want the podium. You've been in tons of comps the last couple of years. What are you bringing to the table this time that's different? Because the car's looking great, and you're saying you're getting that bitch out of you is what's going on. Basically, yeah. So, like... Over the years with truck stickers, like, like I had a lot of issues with the engines and the car was not good, it was not competitive. And we rebuilt the whole entire car last year and now the car is like really, really perfect. And I can drive the hell out of it. I have a lot of laps in this and like like five different iterations of this car. So now like the final iteration, it's just like kicking ass. So, Dude, so. it looks like you're feeling it. I'm excited to see you out there kill it, man. Absolutely. All right, guys, here at US Drift Circuit in our CD bracket. Leo, unfortunately, here got a little bit too much grip in his chase run and did decide to go ahead and hit the wall here. A pretty big hit. Luckily, he is okay from what we're hearing. The car is going to be flat towed out of here, though. He did just redo this car with a yellow vert Corvette that's been running a muck. He loves to get on people's doors, and if he needs to, he'll drive on top of you. What an aggressive driver. Hopefully, the car isn't too damaged so he can come out into this top 32 because everybody that's in the seating bracket is going to be able to compete in the 32 as long as their car is okay. Let's go ahead and wish him well, and we got more coming to you. So, Henry was coming out of the last bank over here in the turn, and his back end hit the wall just a little bit caused him to turn forward before his uh, tire came off the rim, unfortunately. Hey guys, down here with Henry, U.S. Drift Circuit's first round here at Citrus County Speedway. You're in the seating bracket, you've got a lot going on. New car that you've been driving now almost a year it looks like, right? Like a little a little under. My third time driving it. Third time driving it. It's brand new to him, right? And what happened? Just run us through, because we've always got the footage, but what, what was going through, what happened? Uh, probably I was guesstimating tire pressure. I think I put a little bit too much, so it was kind of loose. Mm -hmm. And uh, I chucked it, and I guess, you know, just, just a little, a few PSI of tire pressure could change a lot, so it's just a learning curve and uh, I'm gonna fix it and get back out there. Awesome, yeah, so we had the full wheel come off, right? Yeah. 
the whole wheel broke, so the tire came off. Um, we're checking alignment now. Front looks good. I think I'm just gonna send it. Yeah, dude, you gotta send it. And going back up. Oh yeah, shoot, no hell problem. yeah. So you're just gonna go against the number one or two seat? Uh, like something yes. like that. Something like that, yeah. Okay, you got that. Yeah, you can do it. Well, awesome, thank you for taking the time. I know you gotta work with your team to get that fixed. So, sure. obviously this is a big shout out to remember these guys aren't coming alone. They've got a full team here with them. Big sponsors, lots of stuff. Honestly, these guys are still grassroots tech though and they're doing it all with their friends. So, love to have their help, right? Yes, sir. Well, you guys, will see you soon. out here just fresh off a win staying in the car he's locked in and ready to go he actually came all the way in from Alabama I saw this car on Jackson not even three months ago just painted he is coming out here and absolutely put on a clinic on why he needs to be here he's going for that pro-am license definitely stay tuned and look out for John <laughs> 